Today we're talking about the pros and the cons about living in Flower Mound. So we're going to be starting with the cons, the things that people find least attractive about living in Flower Mound. The first con is the lack of public transportation. Now we're from this area, so driving for us is no big deal, but for those people that are moving in from other areas, it may be a real negative. The second con about living in Texas are our hot Texas summers. Fortunately, it's only two months out of the year, which is July and August, and it definitely makes you want to stay inside where the air conditioning is. The third negative are the bugs and the mosquitoes. We typically don't have hard winters or freezes here to get rid of all the bugs, so the mosquitoes can get a little bit annoying in the, in the warmer months. So you'll just have to be sure to spray yourself down, have those citronella candles around, and, and do those kind of things. The fourth con about living in Flower Mound is the average home pricing. Our average home pricing is higher than the average for the state of Texas. As of May of 2020, our average sales price in Flower Mound is at $470,000. Now, to help offset that, our tax rate is a little bit lower than the surrounding cities to be able to help uh, with that. And the fifth and final con about living in Flower Mound is that we have lots of HOAs or homeowners associations. Now for some people that would probably be a pro because HOAs do help maintain a standard in a neighborhood where people can't just park their cars in their front yard or paint their house lime green. However, it does bring on a little extra expense. The, the cost of being in a homeowners association in a neighborhood is a little bit more as to the, to the cost of living in that neighborhood. Fortunately, there are some areas and neighborhoods in Flower Mound that don't have HOAs. Now what you've been waiting for, the good stuff. The pros about living in Flower Mound. First, Flower Mound is a very active community, so a lot of people are enjoying the miles of trails to explore and also the great parks. As you're exploring the great parks, you can do it either just by walking or riding your bike and just enjoy the beautiful nature. A second pro is that Flower Mound is located pretty much in the middle of the Dallas-Fort Worth Metroplex, which means that it's a 30-minute drive to Dallas and a 30-minute drive to Fort Worth for some great job opportunities. It's also located just within 15 minutes of the DFW airport for those that need to commute. The third pro about living in Flower Mound is that Flower Mound is a very family-friendly community and they have a lot of great activities going on such as concerts in the park, the Independence Festival, and the Arts Festival with so much more. There's always something to do with the whole family. The fourth pro is the convenience factor. Everything you could possibly need is within a short drive and traffic isn't bad. The good thing about this also is that you won't need to refill your gas tank very often. The fifth pro about moving to Flower Mound is our schools. The Flower Mound schools are a part of the Louisville School District, which is a top rated school district in the state of Texas. And not only that, you also have access to the Founders Classical Academy, which is our charter school system here in the area. If you're considering moving to Flower Mound, just download our Flower Mound Relocation Guide, or you can just schedule a call with us and just click on the link below. If you found this video helpful, do us a favor and hit the thumbs up button, leave a comment below if we can answer any of your questions, and hit the subscribe button since we post new videos every single week. Thanks again for watching, and we'll see you next week.